In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the copy, print, and scan with your HP Laser Z Pro MFP3101 FDW printer. Copy is very easy. You can use this printer to copy using the ADF tray or using the scanner bed. For example, I'm just going to use the ADF tray. Go to the printer control panel. Click on the copy icon. Select if you are copying a document or ID. You can also do the two-sided copy. I can just enable it and click on the copy button. Let's see the copy result. So automatically it has copied on the both side. For printing go to your laptop or your smartphone. Make sure your printer is connected with the laptop or smartphone. In the smartphone I can use the HP Smart app. Here you have to just select a document you want to print. Click on the print preview. Select your printer on the next screen and click on the print. You can also do the two sided printing. So printing is done. Let's do the scanning. For scanning we can place all the pages in the scanner bed or on the ADF tray. If you have multiple pages, you can place here. Go to the HP Smart app. Go back to the main screen of the app. You will see there is a scan window. So click on the printer scan. On the next screen, select the DPI. And select if you are scanning a photo or document. Select the source. So I am just going to use the scanner. So that is ok and click on the scan. So you just scanned all the pages. Wait for the documents to be transferred in the app. Scanning is finished. You can save it, share it. On the next page you can just give a name to your file. Select if you want to save it as a PDF or JPEG. For example JPEG. And click on the save. On the next screen you can save it to HP Smart App or any other location. And go to the home. If you want to scan to the USB you can install the USB in the front of this section. Click on the scan to. We can also print documents from it so, so it will give you the option if you want to scan it as a PDF, file name. Again I am just going to place a page on the ADF tray. Once you load a document click on the scan. So scan is done and it is saved in our USB. If you want to do the printing using the USB, you can do the printing. So it has just printed. So that's the way we can do the copy, print and scan with this printer using different devices and USB stick. Thanks for watching.